fellow elected officials, and my brothers and sisters in labor. It's an honor to stand before you this evening and speak to you. Many of you do not know who I am, so I'd like to take a minute to just introduce myself. My name is Lou Rosemilia. I'm currently serving on the county legislature over in Troy. But I'm also now looking toward becoming the next mayor of Troy. I've been endorsed on the Democratic line for the Working Family Party. Thank you. I haven't been in politics long. It's only been a year and a half, actually, that I was in po politics because I've been an educator all my life. I've been in the classroom 40 years teaching accounting and business. And I think that's what we need to get our economy going again. As an educator, I've been in the union for over 30 years. And during my 30 years serving as a union representative, I've been holding many positions. And the most important one I believe I've ever served on was the negotiating team. I understand what you're going through. Negotiators across the table say, you know, you're a dime a dozen. We can find a replacement for you tomorrow. We don't need you. And I know that's what people are going through today. It's the attitude of administration. We need to do away with that. We are working hard. We are working very hard. I stand with the people that are working here, the people of the working people class. Those of you that are serving our children, we got the Troy Council over here, the association. We thank you very much for what we do for our children in Troy. We have health care. We have police officers. We have people working in all areas of life representing the unions. Well, you know, it's, it's time that we look at what's going on. You know, there's times when it's tough. Yes, we've got to make some sacrifices. But when a company is making billions of dollars on the back of our workers and not sharing that profit with them, something is wrong. We need to draw a line, and we've got to draw that line now. So let's be firm, let's be solid on this. I stand with you, and if I become mayor of Troy, I guarantee you that I will continue my stand with you. I will make sure that when we do construction and we start our development, that it will be union representatives working with us. I want to say thank you, thank you for what you do, and thank you for giving me the opportunity to speak with you this